Hi, I'm Kirby Allison, and I'm excited to be back here in London on Sackville Street, uh, right outside Taylor's Kent Haste and Lactor. One of the greatest joys of the bespoke process is the relationship one is able to develop with their tailor. So it is particularly exciting to see this second piece from Terry Haste come together and to be able to add a shirt from Stephen Lactor. So join me as I step inside Kit Haste and Lactor for the second fitting of a bespoke linen suit and the first fitting of my shirt from Stephen. Terry, you guys, you just can't seem to get away from all the construction, can Sorry, you? Who's this? <laughs> oh, right. Mr. Allison. You know, uh, I don't know. have my calling card on. Yeah, you believe it? It's a nightmare, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Uh, so great to see you again. You well? I mean, you know, twice in two months. I mean, for an American, this is a rare privilege. You'll be moving here, so you'll I be know. paying well, taxes here. Yeah, so. so you're on a new board? I mean, I've had to move down. Yeah, well, you're at the end of the one line. One step co closer at the to end heaven. of the line. <laughs> yeah, one step closer to the door, right? <laughs> yeah. Is that Samba? Is that right? Never close enough. Never close enough. <laughs> <laughs> He's the next yeah. one out. Uh, well, That's what she's aiming for. Push yeah. me out the door. That's then right. George well, will move down. Yep. Then Molly will go there. Yep. Well, this is, I guess, how it works, right? It's, <laughs> yeah. you know, um, wow. Well, I mean, you just finished the uh, construction for the restaurant next door. Oh, no. And now they've got a massive project across the street. Mm. And I'm sure next thing you know, they'll be coming, knocking on the door, raising rents. Raising the rates, they <laughs> probably want to dig the basement up, put new drains That's in. right, yes. Um, so anyway, as we have the jackhammer. Uh, well, yeah, they've got the water board starting this week as well, not digging the road up again. They're going to dig the road up. Did they do it last time you were well, I've been out of there. There's been so much construction, you know, on Sackville Street, I can hardly keep track of it all. Um, yeah, it's building yeah. site, isn't it? Yeah. Any updates from John? How's John doing? Yeah, he's um, feeling a lot better now. Yeah, so okay. So hopefully once he turns a corner, well, you know, let us know whenever we'll you know, get the we can, we, out we can get the in. wheelbarrow and roll them in. Um, <laughs> yeah. You know, it was, uh, you know, we'd love to get him on camera again. It's really, you know, get some proper stories out of him. You know, yeah, that, it'd be nice for him to come back, actually. That legend. Yeah, well, I have to say, I mean, the suit, of course, that he and you did are amazing. Looking forward to the most recent video. We've got something with Steven in store. So I guess you guys will, you gentlemen, will have to rock, paper, scissors in terms of who goes first and how we do this. I think. Stephen, nice to see you. Yeah. Young Lactor. Young yeah. Lactor. He's been with us a couple with of weeks now. Start with youth first. <laughs> yes, with pleasure. Yeah. Start with Stephen first. Yeah, yeah. okay. Come so through, let's try your I'll shirt. I'll put the on. shirt on, and can I try them on with the, your trousers? I think it's probably yeah. best. That way you can, yeah, stick the jacket on, and we've got the whole thing going yeah. then, haven't we? You think they'll work together? Yeah. That might change. <laughs> Come through, sir. Thank you. <laughs> After you, sir. I mean, again, we couldn't right. have planned this better. I mean, <laughs> let's. Way. Can we have the braces off? Yep, yeah, sure. They're not fully on anyway. That's it. Okay, let's have a look. I mean, it is right. an absolutely beautiful. How do you feel? Well, it feels comfortable. I mean, the fabric That's is good. beautiful. Yeah, it's lovely. Right, go like that for me. That's good. Jelly good. I know the sleeves are okay. Right, let's get the collar. Have you put on weight, lost weight since I saw you? Uh, there's no telling. It's been, I've, I haven't run any marathons since the last time we saw each other, so, you know, you're doing way oh, better so than John and Terry were the first time. You'll meet, you'll meet me on the way there. <laughs> so you put weight on, Stephen? Yeah, you well, put weight on. <laughs> you know, uh, uh, how do you feel? Good, yeah. Yeah. 
I mean, I like it. I mean, it'll shrink a little bit. It will do. And it's, it'll yeah. shrink about a quarter of an inch, yeah. yeah. I just want to... What are you checking? Your drop, just here. I just want to get that down a little bit. That's not a problem. That's fine. Central line's fine. You happy with the size? Yeah, I mean, I think as I've, in, in my wisdom, right, I've uh, come to really appreciate the virtue a little of a bit, little bit more room. Yeah. I mean, I can, if you want. I mean, maybe a little bit out of the... Put a couple of back darts in. The thing is, you're hollow in the back. Yeah. You can take it out the side seams, mm -hmm. but you're taking it all the way up because you've got to follow a line. Yeah. Whereas a couple of back darts, small back darts, will take away from the hollow of the back. So you won't have to, you know, you won't have to actually try and sculpture the back. Yeah. I probably would throw in some darts. Yeah, just, I mean, you yeah. think it would clean Cut it up as it is? Yeah, it will do. I mean, I do have quite a hollow back. You are, you're hollow back. Yeah. So if I put a couple of back darts in, it'll just take away the excess cloth. Okay. And also, if you're ever putting on weight, which of course you wouldn't do no, so. No, never, never. You can always undo the back darts. Yeah, oh, can you? Yeah. Really? I didn't know that. Yeah. Because, I mean, with a, with a shirt, there's very few alterations that you yeah. can make. You can't do make too much. That's I why mean, I'm looking at balance. Any. I mean, sleeve length, maybe there's a little bit of fabric here, but even this has got such a tight seam. I mean, it's no, really no. well done. Drop your, drop your arms. That's why I asked you to go like that, because you're going to get a little bit of shrinkage okay. on that. Yeah. So, so I, wouldn't, I wouldn't alter the sleeves, actually. Picture the sleeves is fine. Yeah, I just think, I just think taking this away a bit. All right. Collar shape. Yeah, I mean, what do you think of the collar? Looks good. I mean, it's a bespoke sitting, collar sitting shape, nicely. right? Yeah. I mean, sitting, I'm interested in your sitting. eye as a shirt maker. It's sit, I, I mean, my my job is to make it sit nicely. That's the most important thing, and it's sitting it's sitting nicely. Yeah, and um, the shoulders are nice because you got you're similar to me. You're quite sloping. Yeah, you know, as a shirt maker that's been doing this for a long time, do you have in your mind certain collar types for certain faces? Yes. Or? Yeah. For, first of all. You've got quite a long neck, mm -hmm. so you can't have a small collar. The smaller the collar, it's going to accentuate your look. You've got, I've put in a little bit of a slightly deeper band there. Okay. So the height. It's, yeah, so the height of the band is a little bit higher than pr probably a ready to wear shirt. Mm -hmm. So it just stands on you a little bit more. I mean, obviously you can have, make, make a collar Tom as Wolf, deep yeah. as you want, yeah. but I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I think that looks quite a, a solid collar for your, okay. for your shoulder line. Yeah. I wouldn't have too much of a cutaway because if a cutaway goes out, you don't worry about that because yeah. I'm, once I do this, that'll all come up. Okay. That's not a problem. Yeah, and then, you know, nice, Nice uh, arms hole. I don't, I, I, don't think I'd change I don't that. think you take it in anymore. Yeah. yeah. Because if I do, move your arms forward. Yeah, you're going to hit. Like. Yeah, you, no, you got with the shirt. You've got to have mm -hmm. a, a little yeah. bit of room there. And what about the sleeve cuffs? I mean, I, I think that the this cuffs is very, this is very personal. Seem a little bit large. Yeah. So I'd maybe take a quarter. Take a quarter off. I mean, yeah. a quarter off of this one, because this is really the only watch I wear. Right, okay, that's yeah. fine. And then okay. this one, I'd say maybe, let me just know, see. a half. Yeah, let me see. How tight do you like them? Do you like them fairly tight? You know, not tight, but not, you know, not loose, I guess. Right. That's three eighths. Yeah. All can right. you pin it? And then yeah. I can. I mean, three eighths sounds like a three eighths, so that's not a half, right? So that's yes, yeah, just just under a half. So it's a little bit over a quarter. Yeah, so definitely not half an inch. So what happens now is I look very professional and I stick it right through me. Right through your thumb, yeah. I, don't know. I mean, I like that. I wouldn't have. I, it. I, wouldn't have I it. think that we do a quarter. Yeah. Instead of three eighths. Yeah. Right. Let's do just it a quarter. Because we we will have a little bit of shrinkage, won't we? Yeah. You will, because the cuff is cut yeah. upwards. Okay. That's the only way a shirt shrinks. Yeah. It should never shrink inwards. Really? If okay. the body shrinks, then, then you've got a problem with the cloth. Okay, so it only shrinks. It shrinks 
it shrinks. This part of the cuff, yeah, the sleeve shrinks. That's yeah. why your sleeves get a Shortened. little bit shorter. Yeah. And the cuff is cut that way, mm -hmm. so it will get slightly yeah, shorter. That's interesting because in the dimension, the way that the fabric is woven is the straps run vertically that's the right. entire length of the. the that's cloth. right. Yep. Okay. Um, what else do you check for? I mean, you know, again, as a shirt maker, well, what I check is that the one thing that you don't you wait a little bit for the customer to relax, which mm -hmm. you've now done. <laughs> Takes his time way, to settle back in. Yeah. And that way, with a shirt, I hate doing anything with a pencil or a pen. Do it with a, do it with, where you, you drop slightly more. So that one, that mm -hmm. right side will match up with that, okay. that left side. Once it ties on, you get it, you get it nice and clean. You can make it like the paper on the wall, but the thing is, with a shirt, you won't be able to move in it. Mm -hmm. I can make it fantastic. Yeah. But if you can't move in it, it won't be comfortable. It's not comfortable. Yeah. You won't be able to work in it. You won't be able to be comfortable in it. And you've got to be able to, you know, last an entire year's you've got cycle to. of weight gain and loss. Yeah. 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 Quiet. You've got to. I mean, I never do that. Yeah, no, neither do I. No. Not since I've started coming to Kent Haste. Well, Sam was too tough on me. She tries to be tough on me, but I sneak she in the She sent me diet shakes in the mail with my last uh, shipment. <laughs> they didn't work, apparently. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it's a beautiful fabric. It's very soft. It's fantastic. So how, I mean, this is a, I this like this stripe. I mean, can I wear this shirt? Like, would, is it, would you say I can keep this, right? I mean, would you, or would you recommend we making it given the changes that you no, make to I could I could do the alterations. Yeah. I mean, the alterations. Are, I'm very minor. pleased because yeah. they're very minor. Okay. The shirt can be can be worn, but I would like to do the alterations. Yeah, yeah because absolutely. I, I like to, you know. I, like I mean, to it's a beautiful it fabric, and I think you know. Although we didn't plan it, I'd like to say we did it. It works great. Yeah, with it works. With uh, it. It's a, it really is. It's yeah. it's a freshness. Yeah. It's great. It's a nice fresh color. Yeah. It goes very well with yeah. the suit. Well, once we put the jacket on, then we start start really arguing about sleeve length. Ah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, now, Terry, right. I think we might be. We might be nearly know. ready for you. You're ready, yeah. Stephen's quite efficient. I mean, his work's done already. <laughs> yeah. Don't be silly. Nothing <laughs> like fitting you know working with you guys. Well, I do. No. <laughs> I let the junior. Except that you uh, ordered a pink suit, like, a pink <laughs> shirt, though, and this is blue stripe. Blue you stripe. Got well, well, got you know, pink would work, but oh, uh, you know, we had there, braces yeah. and then we took them off. So, so you remember, I did use two of your pins, but three pounds each. Thank, thank you. you. Yeah, that'll be that'll be uh, inflation from your pay. Uh, These are braces, Sam. Thank you, Terry. I was looking for that <laughs> word. So kind. Funny. Looking at them, perplexed. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Yeah, they're, I think, a little you know, <laughs> a bit high. Like, mm. You'll be seeing a much yeah. higher tone if you put them on that I'll time. just stand and watch the professor. <laughs> is, uh, is this how you reset them every time? Is, uh, <laughs> you know, that's, that's how we get our own back. <laughs> make them feel like you've been fitting children. <laughs> yeah. No, just me. We, <laughs> we pull them up for tightness. See, uh, as soon as your voice changes, we know <laughs> Yeah, that's you right know height. you've got the proper height. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Please with them. Do they feel comfortable in the waist? Yeah, they're, I mean, again, one of the things I feel like I'm getting used to, right, is just the confidence that you know you really, if you have a, a pair of high waisted trouser cut for braces, you really yeah, you need you know, the room. You need the room, and that's what gives the comfort. So, yeah, I think this is perfect. Great. I mean, anyway. I don't know if you'd put more room in. Um. You, no, you don't want any more room, do you? It'll just float if you do. But look at the, I mean, again, look at the beauty the of The are hanging perfectly, aren't yeah. they? Makes just a change, the, um, doesn't it? She got one right. You know, yeah. the drape? <laughs> and the, I mean, do you do a slightly larger waistband? Because, I mean, I like this has, again, a nice kind of visual oh, presence. <coughs> probably not with braces. Probably with a straight top trousers, we might do a bigger waistband. But this seems but that's larger than some of my other. What's, the, what's the height? No, that's inch and a half. half. Maybe mm -hmm. you've got an inch and a quarter as usual. We may have had inch and a quarter in yeah. the past. I yeah. mean, not from, I'm not referencing your suits, right? But I'm yeah. seeing other suits I have. This has a little bit of a stronger Slightly visual higher. presence, which I like. You guys are staring at each other now. I don't know. What? No, because <laughs> oh, you could have one that high. Yeah. Got no, <laughs> no waistband, waistband at all. Yeah, mine's yeah. just canvassed. Yeah. I like it. The double, 
pleats, and then we did slightly stronger turnips. Yeah. Yeah, the two inch like. turnips are really nice. And the braces and the shirt and the trousers, I think, all. Yeah, it's lovely well, costume. Sure, goes really well with it, doesn't it? I mean, what it's do you think about the shoes? Fun. I mean, maybe the shoes are a little dark. It depends where you wear it, really. If you're going to wear it in town, you can get away with that quite easy. Yeah. But if you were going to you know, wear it casual to a party or something, yeah. then that would just be too strong. What type so of might... shoes would you have made for a suit like this? Suede. Suede? Yeah. Mm. What color? Brown. Like brown, but like what kind of brown? Slightly lighter. Lighter? Well, lighter than what you're wearing. Yeah. yeah, I wouldn't go too light because it, yeah. it's a bit. So like a chocolate brown or? Yeah, just like. What about pigskin? Would you do pigskin? Pigskin would be nice, yeah. Yeah, but sort of. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Okay. That color. Yeah. That's where I was going. Ah, look at that. That's <laughs> bang on. Telepathy. Um, there you are. Well, these are. Great shoes. Very, yeah. old, very old, cleverly. Yeah, I mean, you can see the uh, yeah. how shiny, uh, how much you polish to the uh, insole they or are, the sock over time. They are seriously old, yeah. like me. Thank you. He bought them on eBay <laughs> last week. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They feel comfortable, yeah? And you've got enough room yeah, in the forks nice and everything. Nice Does that mean I can have a pay rise, Mr. Hayes? No. <laughs> Worth a try. You had one ten years ago. <laughs> You've only been here five years. <laughs> How does that work? <laughs> oh, no, it was me. Oh, yeah. yeah. Sounds about right. <clears throat> okay. I've got a lot to look up to now, haven't I? You've got yours right. Steve's got his right. Whoa. Ooh. The pressure. <laughs> We've got the uh, peanut gallery the over here, the jury pool. Oh, look at this. Wow. This is great. Pen. I've got my own, thank you. I come well prepared. Uh -huh. Today he's learned. <laughs> Unlike Mr. Lactor, who nicked all our pens. <laughs> That's <laughs> right. <laughs> well, so I've come well prepared. I haven't got any chalk. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> I thought I didn't. But <laughs> John didn't take all the pens with him when he left. <laughs> no. Have you still? Has, has he left <laughs> anything for you? <laughs> he nice so think he's got our shoe hold though. No. <laughs> Are you watching this, Kenty? <laughs> we want to have shoe hauling back. <laughs> okay, right. <clears throat> I gave you a bit more across the back last time because okay. obviously this doesn't give like a normal wall gives, mm -hmm. but I think I'm in the shapings. I'm going to leave that bit there. I think okay. you need it. But yeah. we went centre vent on this one just to be slightly different. I think it works quite well. How do you feel? Yeah. Do you like the three button? Yeah, I like the, I mean, one of the things you were saying about linen is that, you know, as it's worn, the roll yeah, will- it will go right, right? So like right now it's quite high, Yeah. right? But over time and once the garment has an opportunity to kind of relax well, once, a little bit. <laughs> even once it's finished, it will probably end up going down yeah, to there. I think that that's nice. Do you want me to bring the buttons down a bit then if you feel that's a little well, bit- Well, I like the idea of it kind of rolling through- Rolling through. Or at least towards- yeah. Because I wouldn't button this top one. No, right? no. I would no. only really button this. Yeah. So I like the idea of it kind of beginning. Just to rolling of, through. And okay. I don't need to roll completely through it because no. I mean, you could put the button right here and you see that in some three roll twos is too much. But yeah. I like the idea of it just slowly. Just kind softly of, roll through. Yeah. That's what the aim is going to be. So I mean, we just got it pressed up. But once you've worn it a couple of times, that really will yeah. just go through about an inch and a half through the button. It's got beautiful structure. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Makes up really well. Yeah. Can we can you pull this off? I can see the pocket. What is it, by the way? That's the hanger. Yeah, a little hang tang. Yeah, <laughs> so we don't lose them. They always put them there. They really sew them on, don't they? They certainly do. Do you have scissors, Simon? <laughs> pocket knife? <laughs> blade? Switch blade? Always, at least two. Do you need snips, Terry? Yeah, I think we need snips on this one. She's really starting it on. Yeah, well, no one's <coughs> you know, tearing that out, double knotted. <laughs> Just tear a hole in it. I always get nervous taking, you know, the little tag off my socks. I know, you always like, cut a hole in it. You can't you? rush it. Like, you really do have to pick it. The amount of times you see people cut holes in. Yeah, I like it. I mean, talk to me a little bit about the pocket. I mean, it's an interesting... 
I well, mean, we went for patch pockets yeah. on this one just to give you something a little bit different. But you know, there's a shape casual. to this where it's. Yeah, you know, it's not. It's not yeah, like I an think Italian. I, line, no, no. I was going to say the Italian ones are really rounded, aren't yeah. they? This is an English, so it's slightly. You can't be the same. I, mean, yeah. <clears throat> I was looking at an Italian one the other day, and it was actually scooped at the front as yeah. well. I didn't quite I like that one, of... but I, quite, I don't mind the, the really round yeah. ones. But we gave you that real English look, which yeah. I think is what we were aiming for. And on it's this. patch pockets, but no bellows or anything. So no. again, quite no, no, we didn't clean. Put, yeah, we just kept it yeah. nice and simple. Thank yeah. you, like I, me. I need my Panama. <laughs> <laughs> I need my Panama oh, be hat. Fantastic with a Panama. Got to go back to Cuba in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah it'd be excuse. brilliant in Cuba. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm just going to raise the collar up a little bit because you're oh, putting film. it off a little bit. Our man in Havana. That was a film. Yeah, and we decided to go with roping on the shoulders, but nothing. Yeah, not you know, a too just, big a rope yeah. though. It's just a slight rope. Yeah. Now getting back to the awkward thing. What do you yeah. think about sleeves? I think the right one's perfect. So do I, and that one's a touch long. Yeah. Is that? Young Mr. Lecter's shirt, those. Let me Slightly. see. Yeah. Well, this is, <laughs> this is the beauty of having your shirt maker and tailor <laughs> all on the same premises, is they can have these fights out <laughs> you know, know, sure, in it? real time. <laughs> My shirt's hit in exactly the same place. It's definitely the jacket. <laughs> Samba. Well, <laughs> yeah. seeing as Terry pays my wages, I always decide on him. <laughs> no, it's that sleeve. It's just yeah. a touch. We'll shorten that. Yeah. The stitching, we're going to stitch on the edge. You don't want it swelled, do you? Where it's stuck, stitched no. in three no, eighths. No, 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 so keep it nice yeah. and simple and, and stitch on the edge. As far as, you know, I do, you know, really tone on tone. Yeah. I mean, not contrasting stitching. No. No, <laughs> no. no, no so I did that once from <laughs> Italy. I went to an <laughs> really? Italian tailor. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, this is, you know, the Italians. He was a Neapolitan tailor. For one, he made my trousers with a full button fly. It was like 14 buttons to actually get to the bathroom, which I know <laughs> I would have said that, you know, I, okay with buttons, but not the fly because either you the pragmatism. Got, you've lost the like, plot. You know, <laughs> yeah. I don't have the. But then he, he also made it with belt loops. And I, he was like, no, you've ordered belt loops. I, said, I haven't worn trousers with belt loops since college. I'm quite certain I did not put belt loops on this. And then. He, he didn't just swell it, but it was double pick stitched and like oh, a no, contrasting yeah. oh, dark brown. Yeah. And I was oh. like, I think it's I was devastated. <laughs> lot of Italian, I was like, yeah. why didn't we talk about this? I mean, at that point, like, what do you do? It's yeah. like. But a lot of Italians yeah. do double <laughs> prick stitch it. Yeah. Yeah. I was okay with the, the double engine. pick stitch, right? Yeah. But it was the contrasting, like, oh, I mean, you that. looked at it. it anyway. Was it a pick stitch or like a saddle stitch where it was quite big stitches you could see? You know, it was. Quite large, right? Quite a yeah. saddle stitch. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe it was even they worse. do it yeah. on the top as well, don't yeah. they? Yeah, because they, they do it on the pocket. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, the Italians, they give you what uh, what they give you now, what you want. Uh, I mean, it was a nice jacket. And <laughs> yeah, they, the other yeah. thing, there was no proper room. And so, I mean, you know, I haven't even tried to. I've given it to Nathaniel already. Nathaniel's 10. <laughs> you know, so <laughs> 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 yeah. uh -huh. Right, let's just have a look. Yeah, no, it's definitely the jacket. I'll let him off on this one. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, well, blame the cut. Pretty much you know. there. Shoulder width's fine, isn't it? Yeah. We narrowed it down a touch last time. Um, <clears throat> How's the back? It's good. The back yeah. is. I mean, the back's yeah. looking really nice. The the vent is hitting exactly where it should be on the mark stitches. Um, I, as I said, I've left you that little bit of room there, mm -hmm. which you really need with this. Yeah. But, it but it's it, sleeves. That's a nice and, thing with. I mean, there's a little bit. I mean, I don't know, is that just linen? What's that? Like, is that... Uh, no, you've not, well, it's not been finished or pressed okay. off or anything yeah. yet. Once that gets pressed off, that will be... Yeah, I mean, even this, the pitch of the sleeves. I yeah, mean, the pitch is really good, yeah. I mean, you're going to, unfortunately, you're going to yeah, get all that yeah, anyway, yeah. because it's just, you only have to move in the beauty of linen, is it, uh, This is gorgeous, and this shirt... I mean, I, we must have spoken about it because this, I feel like, pattern works beautifully with really this well. suit, really well, don't you think? Doesn't it? Yeah. What do you think of the uh, the collar that he made? Yeah, I'm. Yeah, I look. No, I'm a spread collar man. I yeah. love a spread collar. For me, I don't like that collar, but each to their own, really. Yeah. It is. I think it works. I, I mean, it, it, works, it really comes it, under it the. It works well. That's the yeah. important part. It works part. really well. Once yeah. we've raised that it up a bit. Out of a line, that's just like that. Yeah. I made a mistake. You get it we? finished exactly, <laughs> definitely. I made a mistake. Yeah. <laughs> I joined you. You've got to have one. <laughs>
Because I think this really speaks to the virtues of, you know, kind of the relationship with your tailor. I mean, one, we were able to integrate Stephen, right? So we've now mm. got the shirt baking, you know, as a part of this. But then also like the second and third commissions, you know, do get better. It just gets easier yeah. and easier, doesn't yeah. it? Right. Once you get used to it. Yeah, I mean. And also you get used to each other, so. Yeah. And one of the things that I really appreciate is the fact you really, you know, kind of prescribed to this to me. It was a, yeah, a I love this. It's what, it's what I love. I've made it yeah. quite, this style for quite a long time. And it looks yeah. really nice. It's a little bit different now. Yeah. You know, most people think, well, oh, three buttons. Yeah rather than the three button that, as you said, rolls right yeah. through the Italian type, which is really just a two yeah. button. Oh, yeah, again, what I like is that you've got an entire lifetime of experience that yeah. you've drawn in terms of seeing, you know, not just an incredible amount of things <laughs> having been made for an incredible variety of people, Yeah. Uh, but, you know, also through multiple decades of kind of style coming in and out. Mm. And so I think it just gives an eye, right? And then to be able to draw on that, knowing me to make recommendations, I think, Makes yeah, this exceptionally yeah, special. Exactly. I mean, I wouldn't do that design yeah. in a striped suit or, you know, no. like your bird's yeah. eye one you had from John. Mm -hmm. I, that, that's, I think probably for that it's a little old-fashioned, but yeah. for this, I think it's just a little bit different. Okay. Anything else? Any other thoughts? <laughs> no, I think we're there really, yeah. aren't we? We'll just do the finishing and... I mean, how much is left? I mean, this is... <laughs> just a sewing out yeah. now. I mean, so the first suit that we did, how many fittings did we have? It was... Three, was Three. Yeah. yeah. And this will be effectively... Two. two, yeah, right. I mean, you next one will be one fitting. Yeah, yes, that's right. <laughs> and then will you finish the buttonholes and everything? Yeah, take it straight through. Yeah, yeah, because we're there now. Okay. We yeah. just really just got to shorten that one yeah. sleeve, just to make them the same. Yeah, it's got the samba stamp of approval. It does. You look yeah. radiant, sir. Well, thank you. Anything, <laughs> anything we change? That's just. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, no, I'm really pleased well, with that. I mean, you out do yourselves. Brilliant. I mean, great. That's, uh, we'll again, finish next week. If the you're best here. dressed people I know in, in London all share one thing in common: it's that they <laughs> come here and allow suffer you to take care of us. and suffer through you guys. <laughs> um, gosh, this is great. I'm so excited. And you know, again, I don't have anything like it. Nothing mm. at all. Yeah. You don't got any linen suits. At you all. know, I have a navy linen, yeah, double breasted, which I think oh, you may yeah. have I think seen. We saw that actually, yeah. Yeah. But yeah. as you spoke about last time, the navy is really beginning to fade. They go white here, yeah, don't they? and on along the... the edges, yeah, and it gives the cloth a nice kind of patina, kind of like threadbare, yeah. right? Yeah. But you know, it's starting to lose the vibrancy of the navy whenever yeah. I first. Oh, yeah, because um, it's. It's, and it's, it's double breasted. It's not it's yarn much dyed, formal. is it? It's piece yeah. dyed. So that, that's where the color yeah. just rubs off it, doesn't yeah. it? Thank you. There we go. Yeah. Thank you very much. Well, there we go. It's, it's like, I just want to linger. But <laughs> I know that you guys have a lot of work. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Me first. <laughs> wow. Uh, what a piece. I mean, Terry Hayes really outdoes himself. Stephen Lachter with the shirt. And then, of course, Sayumba doing an absolutely exceptional job. Uh, this piece, I have to say, uh, came together really quickly and really speaks to just the skill of these tailors and being able to anticipate, see, and recommend items. I mean, this is that bespoke relationship uh, really at its best. And once you find tailors uh, that you just have good chemistry with, you get along with, it's fun, you're able to joke around, uh, this is whenever it really is taken to the next level. Uh, if you're watching for the first time, the best way to support the content we film on this channel is by visiting KirbyAllison.com. Uh, there you'll find the largest collection of luxury garment care and luxury shoe care accessories in the world, as well as other great clothing accessories for the well-dressed, like this beautiful necktie, braces, and so much more. Of course, I'm Kirby Allison here in London, and as you all know, I love to help the well-dressed acquire and care for their wardrobes while exploring the world of quality, craftsmanship, and tradition. Thanks for watching.